Rise and shine. Nice of you to knock. I didn't want to wake you, sleeping bitchy. Besides, I had to get the list ready. What list? This list. What is that exactly? Since you and I are both officially available again, and tonight is the end of summer beach party, which means partial, if not total, naked nudity, I have made a list of all the available guys so that we can avoid the pain and hardship of another Lucas love triangle. You mean the Lucas is supposed to be Okay, I'm sorry, I didn't get any of that. Did you just say something about me puking at a rave? I said the Lucas you're supposedly dating. Not exclusively. Hmm. What? Huh. I have dated multiple guys before. Yeah, I know. In fact, you are the queen of the multiple boy dating scenario. I'm just surprised you're doing it with Lucas. Mm -hmm. You know what they say when it comes to boys, I'm full of surprises. But I thought you were the new Responsible Brooke. Oh, so last season, Responsible Brooke is good. But Party Brooke is gooder. Check it out. I get Lucas Mouth. Half the guys on the team, I put my first choices here, but we can totally mix and match. Any and all lifeguards, Nathan's Uncle Cooper's so hot. Larry. Whoa. Larry, like, my dad Larry? Of course. He's my hot dad fantasy. Oh. Peyton, he is a total dilf. And besides, I gave you Dan. And I get Dave Grohl from the Foo Fighters. You get Jake, as promised, Nathan, but he comes with an asterisk because nobody knows what the hell is going on with him and Haley in high school married limbo. The other half of the guys on the team, Anna, because, well, you never know, and she was totally into you. And all the Rivercourt boys, skills, Fergie, and garbage. Junk. Right. And finally, the rest of the Foo Fighters. Why do you get Dave Grohl? I want Dave Grohl. No way. So I get a fugitive and a married guy. Fine. You take Dave Grohl, I'm taking Anna. Deal. Deal. Okay. Nighty night. Thanks. Bye.